Today's topic is rainbows. Rainbows are the most well-known optical effects and nature's most splendid masterpieces, an excellent demonstration of dispersion of light and an evidence that light is composed of a spectrum of wavelengths each associated with a different color. A rainbow is a meteorological phenomena that results in a spectrum of white light appearing in the sky as a result of reflection, refraction and dispersion of light in water droplets. You will notice that Refraction of sunlight takes place at two places and reflection of the light from the back of the droplet. These water droplets act as prism and hence white light is separated into seven colors. Now let's see how a rainbow is formed. Now in order to understand how a rainbow is formed, you must be aware of some optical phenomena like reflection, refraction and dispersion. Now let's see what happens when white light or light from sun is incident at a water droplet. This is a water droplet in air. When sunlight is incident at this surface, refraction will take place. And as light is traveling from a rarer to a denser medium, that is from air to water, the light will be refracted towards the normal. Now at this surface, reflection takes place and light will be reflected back into the same medium. There is no change of medium in reflection, whereas in refraction there is change of medium. Refraction occurs at the interface of two media. Now again at this point when this refracted light is incident at the back of the droplet after reflection what will happen? This reflected ray, in fact there will be seven colors which are not so clear here these are again incident at the surface of the water droplet at this point. There, here we will see that a second refraction will take place and in this case light will be refracted away from the normal because it is traveling from a denser to a rarer medium. Water is a denser medium and air is a rarer medium. Another point to note is that red color will be deviated the least now let's have a magnified view of this. See these are seven colors. It is in common language we say it is rib gear, violet, indigo, blue, green, yellow, orange and red. So red is deviated the least and the violet color is deviated the most. The visible region of electromagnetic spectrum shows that violet has the least wavelength which is around 400 nanometers. Hence this color is deviated the most whereas red has the highest wavelength which is around 700 nanometers.